I wanted to just briefly show you something from my book, Pendulum Alchemy Part 1. It's about using your fingers as a pendulum. So ideally, you use a pendulum as much as possible because this protects your energy. Your hand chakra is closed. The pendulum is hanging on a string that's non-conductive. And when you use the pendulum, you have some energetic protect protection. You're putting the pendulum in the energy field, not your hands. Sometimes, however, like in a courtroom, in a hospital, while driving your car, it's going to be impossible to take out a pendulum. Um, and in those cases, you can still do pendulum alchemy by using your fingers. And the way to do this is you close your palm to protect your chakras in your hand, and then you do two fingers out to create the pendulum, and then you just move it clockwise. And what you do, and I explain this in the book in detail, but I'll just give you the quick summary here. You only do things like sending love, raising consciousness, witnessing it all, working out for the highest good. Those things are generally safe to do. If you just send out those intentions, it's totally safe. And those intentions can really help any situation. Like another good one is harmonized relationships. Just do a little quick one. Like if you're, or like I, you know, like send love to everybody. Like I do this all the time in the grocery store when I'm waiting online, I go send love. And you'd be surprised, like a register opens up immediately. Or I witness myself, send love to everybody, harmonize relationships, witness myself getting through here, highest good. You know, something like that. And immediately, boom, a register opens and I have a nice conversation with the cashier, get my stuff and get out of there. Um, so it works wonders and I highly recommend doing this. But like I said, only do it in select circumstances when you can't use a pendulum. And when you do it, protect your hand chakra and only do things like sending love, harmonizing relationships, witnessing it working out. Don't do any healing if possible. Try to use a pendulum for healing because you don't want to contaminate yourself energetically. Anyway, there's more in the book all about it, explaining it. Pendulum Alchemy, it's an awesome book. Please get it. It will be so happy you did. All right, thanks for watching. Bye.